Hello everyone and welcome to PA Academy. So in this video, I'm going to be showing you how to draw a seven-pointed star. A seven-pointed star. So there are actually two methods to go about it. But in this part one, I'm going to be showing you the, the method one of drawing, like I have here, method one of drawing a seven-pointed star. So before we get into this video, please, if you are new to PA Academy, uh, please consider subscribing. It's absolutely free to subscribe to this channel. So just click on the subscribe button and the little bell icon beside the subscribe button to subscribe to PA Academy. Alright, so thank you very much if you have just done that, if you have just clicked on the subscribe button. Now let me know if you've just subscribed through this video. So just drop a comment uh, in the comment section below like I've subscribed and I'm going to leave an appreciation message. Alright, so let's get into this, how to draw a seven-pointed star, method one. So the first thing you are going to need when you want to draw a seven-pointed star is to draw a heptagon. That's a regular heptagon, that's a polygon with seven sides. So if you look closely on your screen, you are going to be seeing a hectagon. I already have a hectagon drawn here. I've drawn it before the video just to save time. But if you don't know how to draw a hectagon, you just check the description of this video. You are going to find a link showing you how to draw a regular heptagon. I've done a video on that. So now if you have your heptagon, so you can just draw it with a faint line because what you actually need from the heptagon itself are the vertices. So this all these points here. So these points, let me call it point A, represent the vertices. This, that's, this is B, so let me call this C. This is D, E, F, and then G. So these are the points that we actually need for us to draw our seven-pointed star. So now that we've identified those points, so starting from point A, so this is point A here. I hope you can see it. So this is point A. So from point A, in this method one, we are going to be drawing a line from this vertex A straight to vertex C, skipping vertex B. So the concept behind this is you draw a line from one vertex, you skip the next one and draw a line to the one that follows it. So we are going to be having something like this. So from point A, we are going to be drawing a line. So that's going to be a broad line, as an outline. From A straight to C, skipping B. So we've just skipped B. So the same thing we are going to do. So from C, we are going to skip vertex D and draw a line to vertex D. So we are going to be having something like this. From C straight to E. And then from E, skip that of F and go to G. And then from G, from vertex G, you skip vertex A and you draw it to B. So you continue in that order where you skip one and then you draw a line to the next one. So you are going to be having something like this at this point. So now from vertex B, you skip vertex C and then you draw it down to D. So if you are already finding value in this video, please give it a thumbs up. So if you have been following uh, this far, so now we are in point D. So where next do you think we are going to be drawing our, our vertex to? So if you are to skip one, uh, the next one and then draw a line to the one that follows, so where do you think we are going to be going? So just note the answer. Alright. So the next one is to F. So let me know if you got that. So let me know in the comment section. If, you are, if your answer is correct. So now that we are on F, where is the next one you think we are going to be drawing our next line to? If we should skip G, we are coming to A. So let me know if you are able to get that. Alright, so with this now, we already have our nine, I mean seven-pointed star. Seven-pointed star. So this is the first method. So in the next method, which will be coming up immediately after this video, it will be coming up somewhere on your screen, at the upper left of your screen. So. That will be showing you another method or another approach of drawing a seven-pointed star. So like I said, if you find a value in this video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you are yet to subscribe, please click on that subscribe button to subscribe to this channel. And with that, I'll see you all in the part two. That is, I'll be showing you another method which will be coming up, which is right now on your screen. So once you click on it, it will take you there. Thank you. Versus